Hi, my name is Peter Fisher and welcome to the second part of the MySQL console tutorials. Um, today I want to focus on dropping tables and removing tables from the database. Um, as we can see here that we've got one tab table called user on the test database that um, I'm about to get rid of. Now before I remove it or, or drop it as the um, syntax is, um, I must point out that uh, once I execute the next command the table, its structure and any records within that table will be dropped, will be lost and um, there, there won't be a way of retrieving that information again. So as a word of warning, if you've got any information in that table, uh, any uh, records that you may need in the future, um, please back that table up. It, it goes for um, dropping databases as well and also removing any re records uh, if you've got any information that you need in the future, then do back that up. Um, I will demonstrate how to back up uh, tables and databases um, <coughs> in a, a future episode of, these, uh, web, of, the, of this webcast. But today I'm going to focus on just removing the table from the database. So, like I mentioned before, the syntax is drop. Um, so what we need to do is drop a table and we give it the table name, which is user. I'll just do a backslash p so you can get a print of that command. <coughs> so drop table user. Um, this is the table name, and these are this is the syntax drop table. If I was to put a semicolon on there and press enter, it will execute this command, and that table will be no more. Like so. Uh, it says query OK, zero rows affected, <coughs> and it says zero rows affected because there isn't any rows in this table. Um, if if there was uh, rows in this table it will tell you how many rows have been deleted so if I go show table uh, show tables now oops sorry show tables uh, you can see that it's an empty set there is no tables on this database because <coughs> I've just removed the only one the users table so my name is Peter Fisher I blog at blog.peterfisher.me.uk um, if you've got any questions, comments, queries on this webcast or any other webcasts that um, I publish, then please do leave comments in the in the comments below, and I'll try and get back to you as soon as I can. Um, you can also catch me on Twitter. My Twitter handle is pfwd. Thanks for watching, and I'll speak to you soon.